What's happening? This is Jerry at Wealth Dynamics coming to you live for Coach's Corner with my friend Nano Aquino. We're both Grant Cardone certified coaches. Today we're coming at you with one message. What is our message today, Nano? It's about leadership and wealth. Leadership and wealth. What does that have to do with each other? Well, first of all, leadership, right? If you come to think about what would be the definition of leadership, one of the, the great definitions that I like about leadership. Two, you know, two of my main guys, uh, obviously Grant, yeah, and John Maxwell, right? Uh, John Maxwell talks about leadership being the ability to influence a person, right? Could be a mom, could be a friend, could be you know a coach, right? And Grant talks about the leadership in the sense of getting a product done, meaning a result, the ability to go from point A to point B, delivering. As you know, as which would be also a definition of a producer, mm -hmm. which also would be a definition of an executive, right? Having a byproduct, end result of something that you set you're forced to accomplish. Exactly, and and with leadership, and well, by the way, I want to mention both of those guys. If you want to see them speak live, 10x growth con. 10x. That's going to be February first through third. Grant Cardone and John Maxwell will share the stage together. It's going to be an epic event. But the reason that that we chose this topic, like Nana was saying, is leadership and wealth, right? And in order to build wealth, which is abundance and prosperity in all areas of life, you have to be a leader. Okay, would you agree with that statement? One hundred percent. And it's if you are, if you're thinking about some of the mountains here, is anyone ever just going to wake up and like, man, I just I fell on the top of the mountain. No. Absolutely not. Like, you have to be intentional to do the, anything worthwhile is going to be uphill. You know, one of the things that <laughs> it's, uh, you know, even working here with Jerry, you know, we, we've been, you know, talking back and forth. It's one thing to take a look at from the sidelines as far as what it's like to be a part of a, a winning team. It's a whole uh, different ball game when it comes to playing <laughs> on the team. Would you agree? I would totally agree. <laughs> and I think that, that the, the team concept and the leadership concept both get romanticized, where people have this idea or this picture in their head of what it looks like. And like you get on a winning team, like you're going to work your ass off. Okay? Being a leader, leader means like means someone who leads. That's where leader comes from. Someone that's going from the front, doing all the work first. So I think there's this this idea that being a leader is like this position where you're like high up and pompous and everyone kind of does everything for you. Mm -hmm. I think a leader <laughs> does all of the stuff. It, it's uh, if anything, uh, it would be quite quite be the difference because uh, seen here, for, I guess from behind the scenes, you know, people. Uh, at one point, I was just you know watching the live videos, uh, you know, from Texas, you know, seeing uh, Jerry talk, you know, do, do the live videos like clockwork. But seeing the behind the scenes as far as the amount of work <laughs> that I, he, he goes behind all of this, it's absolutely insane. It, it, and it's like day in, day out, if this is where we are, this is what needs to be, get accomplished. And this is the work in between. And all, a lot of it is like, okay, I can only see uh, 300 feet in front of me. Once I get there, I'll be able to see a little bit further. And that goes with uh, the, the amount of activity to be done, the amount of uh, inflow as far as uh, the learning that we know that we do, that you know I see you do, that I am personally doing it, as far as what you know, studying solid like on a low end, like two hours a day, that is like out even outside of working hours, you know. So so you know, for that being said, like it's it has to be intentional, and it has to for you know for a financial company that's going to be helping when it comes to the financial side. So that also comes to play as well. To be part of the winning team, you have to also, what does it take to get from point A to point B? And that's what, you know, a lot of as far as what we do here to help our clients. So guys, if you're trying to build wealth, which is what we help people do, okay, make no mistake, our job is to help you build wealth, right? If you're trying to build wealth, like Nan was saying, you gotta know your A to B, where am I at? Where am I trying to get to? And you have to volunteer. No one's gonna do this for you. You have to volunteer to be the leader that's gonna take yourself there, that's gonna take your family there, okay? And, and what we do is we help you get the path, the path put together. Like, like Nano said, nobody falls on top of the mountain. So we're gonna get you on the mountain, but we're gonna give you a plan, coaching, training, like everything accountability. you need, accountability, like the tools, the mittens, you're gonna need mittens, ropes. <laughs> what else do they need? Well, uh, a gun. community. Community? Community, for sure, right? As you're growing, it is called the top 1% for a reason. Because, uh, financially speaking, right? However, 
we do understand that finance is only one of the dynamics of your life, right? It's, it's, it makes absolutely no, uh, no point or, you know, makes absolutely no sense for you to be uh, financially wealthy and have a, you know, the marriage falling apart, right? So it, it's all of this needs to be in place. Why? Because as you continue to grow and distance yourself, why? Because it has to be intentional. So to put in the type of work to do the kind of activity that Jerry and I are doing, it's not per se normal. So a community that understands that allows you to not feel, what would be the word? An outcast? Yeah, invalidated. Correct. Yeah. In order to grow, in order to get from point A to point B. So guys, leadership, leadership and wealth, those two are hand in hand. They go together like peanut butter and jelly. What's something, <laughs> what's something in Brazil that's kind of like they uh, go together? Uh, beans and rice? I would beans say. and rice? Yeah. No, but we can't say that. It's Dave Ramsey. Really? Beans and rice? Okay. We well, can't say beans and rice. Guys, if you're a Wealth Dynamics client, you in your contract in the fine print, it says you can't eat beans and rice. <laughs> <laughs> I guess for the, where, you know, where I'm from, we eat, uh, there's a pastry, a guava pastry with cheese. Have I had that? You haven't had that yet. They do some good pastries. <laughs> so guys, we're gonna wrap up here. Nano, what's one thing they need to know about wealth and leadership? Well, one, for one, you gotta be intentional. Now, if, you, if you're not being intentional, if you, uh, if, first of all, you gotta have the desire, right? Do I actually want to accomplish more for, out of my life, right? Because if you don't, you know, we, mean, we might not be the, you know, the, the, you know, the guys for, for you to even follow, you know, get content from. Now, if you do have a desire to build more out of your life, then for sure, that would start with a desire, right? Mm -hmm. If you even talk about this on, on your book, making a decision to go from point A to point B to reach out to us as far as could be, you, you know, could be watching, you know, just from these live videos or I'm like, man, I'm ready, let's ready to roll. What do I need to do in order to do the steps in order to get from point A to point B with the proven systems not, not that Jerry and I put together, that successful people have done prior and we're following the system and paving the way for you within a community to allow you to get there as well. So guys, that's been Coach's Corner, Wealth and Leadership. Thank you for checking us out. Where can they find you, Nano? Well, uh, obviously Facebook. Facebook. Uh, yeah, and Nano Aquino. And uh, Instagram, uh, Nano underscore Aquino. And uh, what else? Uh, with Wealth Dynamics, of course. <laughs> so guys, thank you for checking us out. Make sure you like, share, subscribe. We will talk to you next week for Coach's Corner. Talk to you guys soon.